lift off. Hi, everyone. Um, happy you're joining us this morning. Um, I'm here with Josh Brook, who, as you may know, is a cellular health expert. He has a company called Vitality Features. He's even written a book on cellular health called How to Improve Your Cellular Health and has a new book that just came out last week. And it is called The Balance Building Book. So um, we're excited that he's taking some time out to answer a few questions for us about the beauty coil. We did a previous video that you may have seen where he did a really excellent and simple overview of the Healy coil. And we've had uh, a few questions since then, and we're gonna go through the most asked questions here in the beautiful way that Das can do it in a very simple way. So, so here we go. All right. <laughs> Let me share the screen. With okay. You. And then we can use my presentation for the questions you have. So before we go to the first question, this was of course introduction uh, picture. And in my last presentation, I made the comparison with thunder and lightning, which is actually also electricity that uses no wires. And it is produced because of a, a difference in polarity plus and minus in the air, in the atmosphere. Warm and cold, when they come together, they create uh, uh, this, this energy. Um, and that is, that's, people recognize this. So it's not the same, of course, what the coil does, but it means that if you use different polarities, plus and minus, and you can create currents without wires, simply in the air, you know? And I guess here we had our first question, is that true? Actually, funny enough, it's it's the second question because, okay. because the most asked question is the question we don't have an answer for. And that is how much does the Healy coil cost? And we don't have that answer yet. But we do know that if you're a Healy World member and you have um, referred three sales of a Healy before the end of the month, you're gonna get a Healy coil for free. So the only answer we know of is you can get it for free, <laughs> but uh, stay tuned for the real answer. Yep, and that's true. Yeah, and then um, another one of the most common questions is, um, is the Healy coil using scalar energy, scalar frequencies? Yeah, it does, it does. As you can see on this picture, um, the, the, the coil, the Biffle coil is two uh, windings that are closely put together and then you can send the current in uh, um, a parallel direction and they will magnify each other, they will strengthen each other, or you can send them the same uh, 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 frequencies into, this, into the opposite direction, and then they will neutralize each other. That is what we call scalar waves. You know, they have exactly the same frequency, they meet each other and they neutralize each other. And that means that at that moment, the energy is still there. This energy is always there. It doesn't get lost, but it has lost its vibration. So if, if there are two waves coming together and they become a scalar wave, the energy is still there. And that is when the energy becomes uh, uh, um, independent of time and place. That is also how we can connect to other sides of the world with the resonance. So the energy is still there, but there's no actual uh, vibration anymore. So both, both the resonance and the coil work at the um, scalar wave level, or what, what they also call the zero field frequencies, where the magnetic field is, is now it is neutralized. 
Fantastic clarification there. Yeah, beyond time and space. Powerful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for that. And I believe our next most uh, frequently asked questions on your next page here, which is, which is how are we going to use the coil and what programs are we going to be able to use the coil with? Well, it, basically, it's it's about the Pink app, so. You connect your coil to your Healy and you are working with the blue app. It has no function. If you're working with the pink app, you can use the coil with all the programs that have this, this sign on top of it. And those are the, the uh, what, what, what Healy calls the IMF programs, the individual microcurrent frequency programs, whereas the programs who do not have that sign, like the pain programs and, of course, this is the European page. You have the Roman uh, numbers here. Uh, but those programs work with the uh, microcurrent, the actual microcurrent, whereas all the other programs work more on a frequency level. So you can see, for example, the acute programs, then they also do not have that sign. And most of these programs work with the eclipse or you know, with the acoustics that you use behind the ears. So most of the programs in the Pink app will work with the coil. You put the intensity at 100, so you don't switch in it, you put it at 100. And then it has a similar effect on your body as the resonance. So it is influencing your energy field, which also means that you can run these programs more often a day, so it's not that you limit yourself to two or three uh, runs. Um, like Christian Halper said on Frequency Friday, he's, having, he's wearing it all day and whenever he wants, he's running a program. Uh, so you can run it as often as you like during the day. Um, and it works with uh, the pink app with the programs uh, that have that sign at the top. Fabulous, perfect. Perfect, clear explanation of that. All right. Um, and then going on to the next page, we're going to find the next most frequently asked questions. And that is, um, again, um, the question of what is the difference between what we're using currently with the microcurrent and currently with the resonance? to what we're getting with the Healy coil when we use it. Yeah. Um, like I always say, you know, I'm not a, a, a quantum physicist and I can definitely not explain it the way that uh, Marcus can do it. Um, but I try to always to explain it in the way that I can understand it and that it is mostly also understandable for, for the people who are using it. You see what we do know, and that, that those are words that Marcus is also using when he talks about consciousness levels, for example, and energy turning into matter and matter being energy. He, he always talks about those three levels, you know, the matter, the physical body, then you have the energy in the body, and then he talks about information. And in one of the last meetings, he was also talking about the fact that energy is holding information, uh, which also means that for example, when you die, your energy stays and it has part of your information. So you could say that that is also a way that that part of you stays in your energy. So if we look at those three levels, then you can say, okay, the microcurrent, the wire programs, they work on the matter level. They, they, direct, they are directed to the cells and they help the cells to improve the energy production. That is, as I said, on the matter level. Then, important function of the cells is to produce the energy that we need to live. And that energy is part of our body. It's inside our body. And with the Healy coil, you can say you are uh, directing frequencies to that energy level, the energy that is already there. Perhaps improving it, but on the energy level. 
And then we have, of course, a higher level, which is the information level, the level of our consciousness of what we think and what we feel. Uh, and that is more touched by, by the resonance. And I always said, you know, a microcurrent is bottom up, starting at the physical body, improving functioning of the cells, producing energy. And when we feel better, when we, when, when we feel physically better, we will also uh, feel emotionally better as a, a connection. And the resonance normally works top down, you know, from the head where we feel and think and things like that. And when we can improve that, when we can trigger that, that will also have a physical effect in the end because they're all connected. So this is, this is how I see it. I guess the three levels that we are talking about with a different function in, in our uh, uh, functioning as human beings. And I was just thinking about uh, driving a car. You could say that the matter is the car itself. Um, so when we send microcurrents, uh, we have a mechanic looking at our car and perhaps improving certain uh, pieces in, in, in the motor block or whatever. Then the energy is the fuel we put into the car to, have it, to, to make it possible to drive. But only with the energy in the matter, the car doesn't move. We need somebody to steer it and to think about where do we go with this car. And that's the, the human mind, the driver. And I, I guess you, you can compare it with that. We have that matter level, a car, we need energy to run the car, but we can only run a car if there is some, some intelligence in there that is steering the car and that is the information level. So if we are working, if we are improving the information level, we are improving our own navigation and what we think about where we want to go to and how we get there. Um, if we want, if we work with a Healy coil, we are getting a better petrol or we are filling it up or things like that. And when we work at the meta level, we go to a mechanic and we, ha we have him look at the car and improve what needs to be improved. So those, those can be compared at the three levels in our body that we, that we work on. I love it. I love that. I love that explanation. And Another of course you need great the more, way. You know, yeah, if, and if the matter, if the car doesn't function, you can put as many, as much petrol in it, and, and you can think about all the destinations you want to drive to, but it doesn't work. And if you don't have the petrol, you cannot drive, even though you know where you want to go. And if you don't know where to go, of course you can drive, but you never know where you end up. <laughs> and, that, and that's the same with, with, with our body and our mind and the unity of the mind, the body and the soul. Yeah, real world. I love that example. I love it. Love it. Another way, another way for us to have a have a simple understanding of, of yeah. something that could be quite complex. Yeah. We all need we all need them and uh, they are connected. And if you influence the energy level, you also influence the matter and the information the other way around. Uh, so that's why we always say, you know, there is no good or bad, or there is no one solution. Uh, it's a matter of combining them as good as possible. Absolutely. And taking advantage of, of all of the tools that we have and knowing their tools and having the gratitude of having the tools and yeah. <laughs> you're good. And as I, and as I said in, in, in the previous presentation, I, I, I feel that the main advantage of introducing the coil is ease of use. Because yeah. we could already... Uh, influence matter, energy, and information with the two options that we have. But now we have this extra option, which makes it easier for us to have the Healy with us. And whenever we want, we can run programs that we need. Um, so it, it's, 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 it's mainly a matter of ease of use and an extra option that we have to improve uh, the, the integrity of our information, energy, and matter. Yes, yes. We're all excited to get our own and be our own test case. Oh, definitely. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to, yeah. and especially because of the ease of use, you know, now, now well, the wires do not keep me from using uh, uh, the pink app, but they are always in the way unless I put the wires below my clothes, <laughs> but otherwise they are still somehow in the way. Yeah. The oil, it, it's, you can easier use it and, and, and share it around. 
Yeah, exciting, exciting times ahead for all of us. And Joss, I want to thank you again. I know you're so incredibly busy and you've taken some time out again to help clarify things in such a simple, great way that you can. And um, thank you everyone for submitting your questions. I really appreciate that. And for taking the time to tune in again. And we wanna wish you a fantastic day, week until we're on here again. So bye. Right. See you again soon. Bye-bye. Okay, bye.